Hello everyone, Derek here from Addictive Tips. In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up your video games in GNOME Games. So to start off, you're going to want to install the app and you can find that installation for instructions for that in the description of this video. Once it's open, if you have some Steam games on here or like uh, open source games installed, it will automatically find them and you can see here it's found my Grand Theft Auto 3. If you want to add a game, now I have a bunch of emulators on my system so we'll add those. So go to the file location and in my case it'll be my Dropbox emulator folder and we go to my Super Nintendo and I'm just going to press Control A to select all of them and then click add. Now we'll automatically add it and if we go to platforms we can see Steam and we can see Super Nintendo. Now what's really cool with the emulators is that we'll automatically start up an emulator and you can play it. So if I wanted to play, let's say Donkey Kong Country, all I do is click on it and it will start my game. And it works. So this is pretty nice if you want to organize your video games. Um, it also, you can add any, like any ROM system or any video game to it, but the thing is, is if you add certain ROMs, so let me show you an example. Go to Dropbox again, we go to Emulators, and we add an N64 game, let's say Star Fox 64, and I go to Nintendo 64, it's not going to work because the support for it isn't planned. So it's really hit and miss right now, but it does handle SNES ROMs and it does pretty well with most stuff. And if you're just looking for a nice way to organize your video games, that's what you can do. Anyways guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one.